In this video, I have created a guide to show you how to play Skyrim with a new concept using a combination of mods for the year 2024. I have added new content to the existing Skyrim that can make it more boring, and I have introduced my own way of making the game more fun and immersive through the video. Please watch the video until the end, and don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on the notification bell. So, without further ado, let's get started. First up is permadeath content. This content will allow you to play Skyrim in a very tense state, because if you die even once, you have to press the new start button. The most representative mods to add this are Die When Killed mod or Dead is Dead mod. However, if you use this mod, you have to keep playing the early part, which can be boring, so you can use alternate start live another life mod or alternate perspective mod together and set the start randomly. This way, you can wander around the Skyrim world by reincarnating with a different concept every time you die and start anew with One Life Skyrim. If you add needs content like Sunhelm and remove fast travel, you can experience a different fun that you have never experienced before in the Skyrim world. In fact, in the game, you have to eat and drink or sleep when you get tired, and if you don't eat or sleep properly, you will die and have to start over. These elements will make you feel like you are really in the Skyrim world, and because you only have one life, you will be able to maintain tension and you may have to steal food to survive. Let's add hardcore saving overhaul to upgrade the hardcoreness. If you do this, when you first sleep in a bed, a lucky coin will fall near you, and if you click it in your inventory, you will never be able to click the save button and only save when you sleep. This will make you realize how important bedroll is in the Skyrim world. You have to find a bedroll and act carefully to find a save point. However, if this is too hard for you and you want to make saving easier, you can use Simply Rest Anywhere to make saving easier. You can sit, lie down, or sleep anywhere by pressing the designated hotkey. However, sleeping is only possible once every two hours, so it prevents you from abusing sleeping. If the game is too hard because of the mods introduced earlier, you can use this mod to make the game a little easier. Next up, I want to enhance the content of Skyrim Septum through modding. As you know, Skyrim uses Septum for all transactions, and you will sell the items you acquired to merchants and carry them as Septum. However, there is not much content that can be implemented with Septum in reality. You can only buy equipment, houses, or hire mercenaries. Moreover, if you acquire SPID equipment added by Wabajack, Modpack, or Mod from the beginning through looting, you will have too many Septums in your inventory once you reach level 1015, and the game will become boring. Essentially, Skyrim has a very weak motivation to collect Septum, so you need to supplement it with Mod. One way to supplement this is the Gold is Soul mod. Gold is Soul allows you to upgrade your Skyrim skills with Septum. It may sound absurd, but you can give your Skyrim a lot of new fun with this mod. Gold is Soul, first blocks, all the existing Skyrim skill upgrade methods and allows you to upgrade your skills only with Septum. You have to collect Septum somehow to level up. In this situation, you have to make money in the Skyrim world somehow, and this will make various content more lively. Especially, trade is important. Now you have to seriously think about commerce to level up your character. One option for this is dungeon exploration. You can acquire various items through dungeon exploration and sell them to merchants. Here you may have a question. Why do you have to sell items only to merchants? You can solve this problem by adding a mod. It is Immersive Speechcraft. Immersive Speechcraft is a mod that adds various dialogue options to all NPCs. You can extort money from NPCs, train skills, make them follow you, give them gifts, or start a fight. But especially this mod provides a dialogue that allows you to trade with all NPCs. Through this, you can sell the items you looted to all NPCs. Depending on your speech skill, the NPCs are more likely to respond to this request and you will have to seriously consider investing perks in your speech skill, which was usually neglected. However, in this case, 
The existing NPCs have too little septum to trade, so you need to enhance this with a mod. With more NPC pocket money SPID, you can make all humanoid NPCs have more pocket money. Through this, you can persuade NPCs to sell your items to them, level up with the septum you acquired, or secretly steal their septum and level up. Of course, you can set gold is Souls MCM to drop more money for all actors, but this option depends on the value of the enemy's health to distribute septim, so some enemies with excessively high specs sometimes drop too much septim, and the game becomes easier, so I do not recommend this feature to you. Rather, I think it is better to make NPCs carry more septum with more NPC pocket money spid, and enhance the contents such as theft, robbery, or trade through this. Next up is a Enhance Hunter contents. The Hunter profession used to be a really boring content of Skyrim, but last year, Simple Hunting Overhaul was added, which enhanced the Hunter content. Especially, Simple Hunting Overhaul has a feature that allows you to sell animal corpses to merchants. You can use this with Gold is Soul to level up your skills with the septum you get from selling animal corpses. This allows you to choose to upgrade your skills by picking up mud crab or wolf corpses around the village at the beginning of the game and selling them to merchants. However, the problem with the existing simple hunting overhaul is that the selling price is too cheap compared to the weight of the animal corpse. You brought the animal corpse from the field with difficulty, but the amount the merchant offered you was only 25 septum. The amount is too low compared to your effort, so you need to increase it. Fortunately, Simple Hunting Overhaul, MCM mod, provides an option to increase the selling price of animal corpses. Try setting the selling value of all animal corpses 10 times higher through the MCM menu. This way, you can sell animal corpses like mud crabs for about 250 septum and use them to increase your skills in the early stages. Not only that, but sometimes you can hunt a good quality deer in the field and sell it for 750 septum, or a giant mud crab for 2,000 septum, and you will look at the rabbits and deer that you use to pass by from a different perspective. With that, we conclude our guide video that enhances Skyrim's content, adding a unique twist with features like permadeath. As we enter the new year of 2024, we hope you experience a different kind of joy in Skyrim through this video. If you found the content helpful, please support us by subscribing, liking, and hitting the notification bell. Additionally, your support through Patreon greatly contributes to our video production. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video. Until then, happy modding.